Hey, what's up, guys? Ancient here, bringing you something different. I've recently uh, been getting into Magic the Gathering. Not Well, I, I bought a physical deck a long time ago. I just don't have anybody to play with because I live in a pissant hick town millions of miles away from any of my friends. So, I've been getting into the new Magic the Gathering game on Steam, I believe it is. No, no, I don't think it is on Steam. But anyway... This game is currently in beta, and it's genuinely super fucking fun, even though, like all card games, it relies a lot on card draw. Which can be super frustrating at times, when you don't draw any land cards for 7 turns, and then your opponent fucking destroys you because he has 12 land, and you have 4. But, um... Yeah. Uh, anyway, I bought a shit ton of... A shit ton of card packs, because reasons. And I'm gonna unwrap them. Here. On, not on stream, but on YouTube, because why the fuck not? Figure may as well show everyone me getting shit cards, because that's my luck. Amara, Soul of the Accord. Good thing I don't play green-white, otherwise that might have been useful. That's not a bad card, I play green-black a little bit. That's also not that bad of a card. Ooh, discard a creature card, er erstwhile, trooper, oh. Um, that's not that great either, because the problem that my black deck has is, or my black green deck has, is that I can't get creature cards on the field that easily. That, however, oh my fucking fuck, that's good. Another problem it has is that I can't deal with large numbers of creatures, so that is, that's actually really good. Uh, yeah. Let's get into the next one. Ha ha! Well, roughly the same. Hm. Uncommon wild card. That's, that's good. Whenever you cast... Yeah, fine, whatever. I don't play blue at all, so whatever. Oh my god! That is so fucking good, except, uh, creatures... Well, still good. Who knows? It'll be good against, like, merfolk decks. It's a sorcery, though, not an instant, so I can't use it, like, after it, my opponent attacks me and everything's at low health. That's too bad, but whatever. Still good. Oh, Capture Sphere. Cool! It's one of those bullshit fucking aura spells that, that Blue can use to just permanently take your creatures out of the fight until you can remove it, which very few things can, so... Yeah. Wonderful. Drowned Secrets. Well, still a, a color that I don't play. But that's not bad. Whatever. Maybe at some point I'll make a blue-black deck or something. Uh, I don't play red-white either, so whatever. Hmm. A 1-4 spider with reach. It's not too bad. Only costs 3 mana. Uh, none of anything else is useful to me. Yay. This this card opening session, or this pack opening session is going really well so far. Very few cards that I'm ever going to use. Ritual- <gasps> oh, I finally have Ritual of Suit! Oh my fucking god! I've been trying to get this card for so long! Oh, that's so good. Oh, it's so goddamn good for me. Uh, artifact. I don't. I, well, I have an artifact deck, so I guess that's not terrible. Except what? It deals three damage to target creature. Okay, that's not terrible, I suppose. It's kind of a roundabout way to to just have a a three damage thing. I may as well just have a lightning bolt in my in my deck. Then again, you know, only red decks have lightning bolt. Um, ooh, that's not bad at all. Enchanted creature gets 2-2 and can't block. Okay. I guess I could use that. Oh no, my artifact deck is white. I think it's white green. Maybe it's white blue. I don't know. I was gonna say, maybe I could use that for my, artif for my artifact creature that can only attack. 
with and it has it's like a six one with trample I think, and it costs four mana. It can it can purely attack. Doom Whisper, huh? It's not bad. You can only get this through packs as well. You can't get this with wild cards, so that, that's that's pretty good. Yay! A gold wild card. Ah, oh, cool. Dead weight. Nice. I've been wanting to get that. Again, you can only get that with uh, with packs. You can't get that with wild cards. Nothing else that's really all that good for me. Risk factor. Ooh, that's pretty good. I see why everyone uses that in their deck. I don't know why I suddenly lagged there. Uh, Golgari Locket. Hmm. Not terrible. I could use that for my black-green deck. Another Moodmark Painter. I already have one of those. Nothing else that is of any use to me. Oh. Yay. A fucking blue-red deck. Once again, something I don't play. Or a blue-red blue car card. I don't have a blue-red deck. Uh, target creature can't be blocked this turn. That's not terrible. If only I played blue. Charnel Troll. At the beginning of your upkeep. Hmm. Hmm. That's not great because black decks build themselves on taking things out of the graveyard. Hmm. That's not terrible. It's basically the, uh... Um, the va the blood card, I forget what it's called, but it, it does basically this except for the second effect when, from, the, uh, that where you exile it and do it again. It's not terrible. Convoke. Eh? Oh. Huh. That's cool. Siege Worm. Take Heart? Oh, right. Oh! Take Heart as in, like... The midi- the, the, the saying, like, be brave or some shit. I thought it was, like, actually taking someone's heart. That- that- that escalated quickly for a second. Fucking wow. Yay, a wild card. Undercity Necrolisk! Oh my god, yes! Never happened. Uh, well, there's nothing else that's really good. I still don't play... Well, I mean, I do play white decks, but... Ooh. That could be good for, like, a black... Uh, a black-white deck. That creates token creatures and shit. Just get, like, a, a black-white swarm deck and then get, uh, open the graves. That'd be so useful. Open the graves is the thing that creates, uh, one, uh, two, two black zombie creature I tokens. I am head off. Okay. I'm probably gonna pop up in, like, seven, eight hours. Alrighty then. Boo -boo. He can't hear me. And I presume... He has no idea that I'm currently recording this. D destroy target color. Oh, okay. I thought it said land permanent. That'd be useful. Being able to destroy someone's land. Oh, yes. Ritual of suit. Yes. More. More ritual of suit. The more I have of that, the better. My distinct lack of ritual of suit has been fucking my black deck so hard. Fungus Zombie? Rhizom Lurcher. Hmm. Useful. Very useful. Yeah. Once again, don't play blue-red, so useless to me. 
Yes! Another mythic red or mythic rare card. Uh That's pretty cool. Get free land. That's also pretty useful. Useful for a red deck. Awesome! Mythic rare card! Smeltboard Minotaur, huh? Nothing else of any real interest in this. Devious cover-up? What does this do? Counter-target spell. If that spell is countered this way, exile it instead of... Huh. Not terrible. Yeah, whatever. Nothing interesting in that in that pack. Sonic Assault. Yeah, nothing really interesting in here either. Nothing for any decks that I use anyway. Still. Drowned Secrets. Hmm. Arbitorium Elemental. That's not bad. Hexproof. Hexproof is always good. Uh, nothing else interesting, though. Yep. Not interesting at all. Glowspore Shaman. When Glowspore Shaman enters the battlefield, put the top three cards of your library into your graveyard. You may put a land card from your graveyard on the top of your library. Vulcan and Trent, yeah, another siege worm. Uh. Hmm. Underrealm Lich? Hmm. Okay then. Wait, huh? What the fuck is the point in that? I guess if you think your opponent's going to use, like, Shock or Lightning Bolt or something, or Murder, to destroy it. That's uh, kind of weird. Uh, Plague Crafter, I think I already have one of those. Ooh, Undercity Uprising. Oh, that's so good! Oh, that's so good! I'm definitely putting that in my deck. Thief of Sanity. Whenever Thief of Sanity deals combat damage to a player, look at the top three cards of that player's library. Exile one of them face down, then put the rest into their graveyard. You may look at and cast that card for as long as it remains exiled. Wait, what? Oh my fucking god, so you, you literally just get a, like a free, a free pass to cast a spell that you've exiled, and the, the enemy does not gain access to that spell. That is amazing. Chamber Sentry. Cool, I think I have one of those already. Nothing interesting. Except for the wild cards, I suppose. Uh. Portcullis Vine? Inescapable Blaze? <laughs> Hellkite Whelp. Hmm, Double Strike, Vigilant, and Trample. Well, too bad I don't play white-red. Cosmotronic Wave. Risk factor again, huh? Um... I mean, that's pretty good board clear, I guess. Although there are a few... Oh, Saprolings. That'll be good against Saprolings. One of the most cancerous decks in the fucking game. Fuck saplings. Pitiless Gorgon. That's not terrible. Death Touch is really fucking strong. Thousand Year Storm. Ooh. Oh, whoa, what? You can just... You can copy any spell that you've 
It's an enchantment, too. Wait, wh wait, what? For every spell that you've cast before this turn... Oh, before it this turn... Okay, then. Fucking... That... That escalated quickly for a second. I thought it would... I thought it would be like Yog saron where every spell that you had cast before that turn, it would cast again. Oh, that could have been insane. Yeah, nothing really interesting here. Give me something cool! Um, once again, nothing really interesting. Ooh, what is this? A blue-black one. Tap target creature, target creature, yes, yeah, whatever. Ooh, is Zoni thousand-eyed? I don't have this one yet. Hmm. That's so fucking good. Oh my lord, I am definitely using that. Uh, still, once again, nothing interesting. Oh well. That's pretty good. All creatures able to block? <laughs> A legendary dragon. Cool. I may have to make that dragon deck soon. I hope I get the undead dragon soon. I fucking want it so bad. All creatures gain minus one, minus one. That's pretty cool. I already have that. Mausoleum Secrets. Search your library for a black card with converted mana cost less than or equal to the number of creatures in your graveyard. Cool. Uh, nothing really interesting here. Tajik, Legion's Edge. Haste, Mentor. Prevent all non-combat damage that would de be dealt to other creatures you control. Holy fuck. That is super strong. I may actually have to start playing white red if I'm going to be getting this many that this many strong cards. Another glow spore shaman. All right. Underrealm Lich. If you would draw a card, instead look at the top 3 cards of your library, then put one into your hand and the rest into your graveyard. I don't know if that's good or bad. Because the thing is, the way I build my, my black deck is to make my opponent discard as many cards as I can. So that one would be working against me, rather than with me. Bounty of Might, yeah, I already have that. Crawl Harpooner. When Crawl Harpooner enters the battlefield, choose up to one target with flying that you don't control. Uh... Oh, okay. That's that's not terrible. Crawl Swarm. Hmm. Four one. I don't. S mm. Five mana. Not quite worth it. Gruesome Menagerie. Choose a creature card with converted mana cost one in your graveyard. Then do the same for creature cards. Ah, oh, that's not terrible. Barrier of Bones. That's also not terrible. Child of the Night. I already have that. Uh, yeah, whatever. Quasi duplicate. It's not terrible. Too bad I don't play blue. Oh, Arclight Phoenix! Flying haste at the beginning of your com beginning of combat on your turn. If you cast three or more instant and sorcery spells this turn, return Arclight Phoenix from your graveyard to the battlefield. Interesting. It's only a 3-2 though, but whatever. Still interesting. Uh, 
nothing that's cool for any other decks I play. Yep, that's that was a worthless pack. Oh well. Lifelink. Dowser of Lights. Hmm. It's a horror. Yeah. Nothing too cool. Fire mines research. Yeah, whatever. Still, whatever. Glaive of the Guild Pack. Yeah, whatever. Ah! Veiled Shade. 1-1, one, one, huh? Another one of those. That's, that's good. Connive Concoct. Okay, then. Another Veiled Shade. Another Charnel Troll. Did I just get another Mythic War Rail card? Okay. Nothing good here. Swarm Guild Mage. Creatures you control get plus one and menace until end of turn. Fuck, that's... that's fucking strong! That is... Midnight Reaper? Whatever it... ooh... Uh, hmm. Well, then again. Don't know. I'd need a lot of lifelink for that. Maybe that'll be good for, like, a black-white deck. Plague Crafter. Luminous Bonds. Fuck this card. Fuck this card with a burning pitchfork. Luminous Bonds has lost me more games than I can count. It needs to die in a fire. Yay, more dead weight. That's not terrible. Another Midnight Reaper to uh, card. I don't think I'm ever going to use that. Hmm? No. Oh, that's... Not that useful. May as well just have a regular land card. Or then again, hmm. Could be good. Yeah, the Veiled Shade, huh? Yay! Mythic Wild Card. Mnemonic Betrayal. Eh. V v vigor Spore Worm? Why did I- why did I tremble when I was saying that? Why am I terrified of Vigor Spore? Legendary Creature, Shapeshifter. Comes a copy of target creature card in your, in your graveyard with converted mana cost X, except its names is Lazav, the Multifarious. It's legendary in addition to its other types, and it, it has this ability. What, to become a copy of stuff? Hmm. Doesn't seem awful. Book Devourer? Oh, I would not get along with this dude. I love books. Huh. Discard all cards in your hand. Don't know how much I would like that card. Uh, another Arbitorium. Molder Hulk? Fungus Zombie. Spell cost one for each. One less. Enter the battlefield. Target land card from your graveyard to the battlefield? Why the fuck would I have land cards in the graveyard anyway? I mean, unless my opponent forces me to put them in the graveyard, but that's so situational. Nice! A mythic rare wild card. Crack 
crushed contraband. Oh yeah, that. Uh. Huh. Urza the si or Etrata the Silencer can't be blocked. Whenever he deals combat damage to a player, exile target cre. <laughs> what? Put a hit counter on that card. That player loses the game if they own three or more exiled cards with hit counters. On what the fuck? So if it if Etrata the Silencer turns up t three times in the game, you automatically win. That's fucking insane. Radical idea, huh? Eureka! They should have just called the card Eureka. Oh. That's not useful to me. Well, I suppose that's the end of this card card pack opening session. Uh, for some reason, I've seen a lot of people that enjoy this whole thing, so... I'm sorry if you did not enjoy it, and if you did, I'm happy about that. Um... Yeah, please comment with feedback, like if you enjoyed, and, uh, uh, comment if you want to see actual magic content on this channel, if you want to see me playing magic, cause I get fucking infuriated when playing this game, because it's a goddamn, I do not have good luck with card draw, it's, it's unbelievable, and I'm pretty much just a pile of steaming, burning bullshit at this game anyway, so yeah, uh, yeah, I'll be coming out with more Alien Isolation and probably some other Obscure 2 and other games soon enough. See ya!